Hi friends, welcome to channel Agribiotic. I am Ganesh Thakur. In this video, we will discuss on some important and previously asked questions from reproduction chapter. This video is important for those who are preparing for NEET and other competitive exams. So try to solve all the questions and write in the comment box how much questions you solved correctly. So let's see the first question. How many nuclei take parts in double fertilization of flowering plants? And the given options are 2, 3, 4 and 6. And here the correct option would be C, 4. The fusion of one male gamete with the egg and another male gamete with the secondary nucleus is called double fertilization. Since Two type of fusions, syngamy and triple fusion take place in an embryo sac. The phenomena is termed as double fertilization, an event unique to flowering plants. A total 5 nuclei take part in double fertilization, sometimes called 4 as the two polar nuclei fuses to form 1. So here for this question, correct answer would be 4. Next question, sexual mode of reproduction in protozoa and the options are anisogamy, plasmogamy, plasmotomy and schizogony. And here the correct answer is A. Anisogamy. The fusion of two different gametes which differ in size, shape and behavior is called anisogamy. So here the correct option would be A. Anisogamy. Come to the next question, flagellated male gametes are present in all the three of which one of the following sets? Anthesiros, Funeria and Spirogyra, Zegnema, Sprolegmia and Hydrilla, Rixia, Dryopteris and Cycus, and last one Fucus, Marsilia and Calyptropis. And here the correct option would be C. Rixia, Dryopteris and Cycus. Flagellated male gametes are present in Rixia, Dryopteris and Cycus. So for this question, correct answer would be C. Come to the next question. Seminal plasma in human males is rich in fructose and calcium, glucose and calcium, DNA and testosterone, ribose and potassium. And here the correct answer is A. Fructose and Calcium. Seminal fluid is fluid that emitted from the male reproductive tract and that contain sperm cells. It is also called semen. Seminal plasma in human males are rich in fructose, calcium and certain enzymes. So for this question correct answer would be A. Fructose and Calcium. Next question is. Testes descends into scrotum in mammals for fertilization, development of sex organs, spermatogenesis and development of visceral organs. And here the correct answer is C. Spermatogenesis. For sperm formation, spermatogenesis requires low temperature. So testes descends into scrotum in mammals for spermatogenesis. So, for this question, correct answer would be C. Spermatogenesis. Next question, structure absent in frog's testes is and the given options are interstitial cells, sertoli cells, seminiferous tubules and seminal vesicles. And the correct option would be B. Sertoli cells. Sertoli cells are the characteristic of testes of mammals. So these cells are absent in frogs. So here the correct option would be B. Sertoli cells. Come to the next question. The ovule attached to the placenta of ovary wall by micropyle, raphe, funicle and hilum. And here the correct option would be C. Funicle. 
A filamentous stalk attaching a seed or ovule to the placenta is called funicle. So for this question correct answer would be C funicle. Next question is which one of the following propagates through leaf tips? And the options given are walking fern, moss, sprout leaf plant and marchantia. And here the correct option would be A walking fern. In walking fern, the tips of leaves given out adventitious roots when comes in contact with the soil and produce new leaves and develop new plant. Walking fern is also called as adiantum. So for this question correct answer would be A walking fern. Come to the next question. What would be the number of chromosomes of the alluron cells of a plant with 42 chromosomes in its root tip cells and the options given are 84, 63, 21 and 42 and here the correct option would be B63. The alluron layer is the outermost layer of endosperm that is 3N. Since the cells of alluron layer are triploid the number of chromosomes would be 63. So for this question correct option would be B 63. Next question development of sporophyte directly from the gametophytic tissue called parthenogenesis, parthenocarpy, apogamy and apospory. And here the correct answer is C apogamy. Development of sporophyte directly from the gametophytic tissue without fusion of gametes is called apogamy. While apospory is the production of gametophytes directly from the diploid cells of the sporophyte without spore formation. So for this question correct option would be C apogamy. Come to the next question. Chromosome number is halved during and the options given are meiosis 2, formation of first polar body, formation of second polar body and division of secondary oocytes. And here the correct option would be B formation of first polar body. Meiosis 1 takes place in primary oocyte and the formation of first polar body and secondary oocyte takes place and chromosome number becomes halved. So for this question correct option would be B formation of first polar body. Next question long ribbon like pollen grains are seen in some and the given options are aquatic plants, gymnosperms, wind pollinated grasses and bird pollinated flowers and here the correct option would be a aquatic plants in most aquatic plants pollen grains are ribbon like and long and are protected from wetting mucilaginous covering hence for this question correct option is a aquatic plants come to the next question process of fusion of haploid cells is and the options given are meiosis, mitosis, syngamy and cell cycle and here the correct option is C syngamy. Syngamy is the process of fusion of two haploid cells that is one male gamete and one female gamete. So here for this question correct answer is C syngamy. Next question is vegetative fertilization is also known as and the options given are syngamy, triple fusion, true fertilization and generative fertilization and here the correct answer is triple fusion. During syngamy, first male gamete fuses with a female gamete and zygote is formed. 
then other male gamete that is the second male gamete migrate toward the secondary nucleus and fuses with it this phenomena is known as triple fusion and results in the formation of triploid primary endosperm mother cell triple fusion is also known as vegetative fertilization so for this question correct answer is b triple fusion come to the next question insect pollinated flowers have pollen with large quantity large sized pollen sticky pollen with rough surface small pollen with dry surface and here the correct answer is c sticky pollen with rough surface due to the sticky and rough surface of pollen grains these are attached to the insect's body parts which help in transfer of pollen from one flower to another flower so for this question correct answer would be c sticky pollen with rough surface thanks for watching please like and share this video for any suggestion comment in the comment box and don't forget to subscribe our channel agribiotech thank you